Yo, what's up, everybody? It's your boy, The Ghetto Ogfer, aka Pastor Tech, coming back at you with another unboxing video. And today, what we're going to be unboxing is something I got off the internet. I was on my Facebook timeline one day and I saw this. I said, Hey, First Lady Tech. She said, What? I said, Can you order this for me? And she said, Yes, she did. So today, we're going to be unboxing the Pocket Tripod Pro card size tripod for, mo for mobile photography universal kit. There we go, let's see if we can get it in focus. Booyah, there we go, there we go in all its glory. And normally I don't do something like that, but I thought it was something good. So here it goes, and when we open it, it's very simple, let's open it. it comes with, I guess, a size to um, geometrical fit card. So I guess you can size up your mobile device. Um, it says time left is good. I, all you need, sorry, all you need idea for keeping your phone steady for hours so you can create stunning time-lapse photography. Um, good for video calls, no more shaky cam. Uh, okay, no more shaking cam. You can do hand-free video calling. Uh, you can do long exposure photography and you can do photography. I'm um, just sit down, you know, with the Samsung, we can put our hands up, do like this, it'll take the picture. All right, so it got all that. I'm supposed to be wallet size. So here we go. So what we're going to do, we're going to get into the unboxing and see how the unboxing experience is. So from what I understand, you have to pull these. It says pull this tab here. So I'm going to pull this tab. Okay, I'm going to see. Okay, here we go. Pow. Pull this tab here. And pull the other tab. Ah, okay. And then we can open it up. Okay, we open it up. Okay, coupon for adapters. I got a coupon, uh-oh, for some more adapters. Okay, let's see how we gonna do that, how we can use the coupon. Get more adapters so we can, we can actually fit more phones in here. Okay, we got this, okay, we got the books. Okay, right now we got the books, um, important. Um, never been the two have this will damage the center hinge so we never want to bend it uh important do not press the center pin against the top hinge okay never do that okay so we can never do those things good to know they put that they put that right in the front of it important don't mess it up all right so i'm gonna have to actually read this to see how we can use it okay so this is one of them we just don't pluck and throw away we're going we're gonna to put this right here. We come with another thing. Um, tag us in your unboxing story. So I might tag them. I might tag them for my unboxing story. Very good unboxing. Okay, what we have right here, I'm going to show you. We have the inside here, we have the different hinges. Um, this thing actually flexes. So these little circular things are the hinges that come out. Let me see if I can... If I can get one out, so if I can get one out before I take the main thing out, the hinges. Okay, I dropped the hinges. Uh oh, I messed them up. Well, I didn't mess it up, but these are two hinges. Okay, there's two hinges within one. So this is how the hinges look. It goes on there to see if you can see it. I'm sorry. They're, I think that's the best I can get it to do. These are the hinges that comes with it. So I'm gonna put these back in where they belong. Um, before I lose them, I'll be mad because. I lost them. And I don't know if I put them in the right spot, but um, we're going to put them back somewhere for right now. Okay, I got it going upside down. Okay, there we go. I think it goes in this one here. Woo, okay, so we're going to take out. Now, this is light. And let's peel it. Oh, we peeled it. Okay. Now this is supposed to be able to fit in your wallet. Um, supposed to be able to fit in your wallet. So look how thin this is. This is actually very thin. This is actually, let's see if I can get it in. Yeah, this is very thin. It's supposed to be as thin as a credit card. So um, the way they said, now I'm gonna see if I can What I'm going to do before I do that, 
is I'm going to let y'all go get some, um, go get some pizza rolls, go get a, uh, a Nas, go get something to eat real quick, and I will be back. Cause I Yo, wanna, I'm finally back. Hope I didn't keep you waiting long. Now, I know how to use it a little bit better. So basically, the way it works to get it to become a tripod, you have to take it. I hope you can see this. You have to take it. You have to twist it. Go around like this. Make sure it snaps in. Then you take these sides and you flip it in. Like that. So, then you can set it down. Then you can take your phone, and this is where the different size circular things right here, these hooks, your phone set in. You can get different sizes. They do come with different sizes for different size phones. So you can put it like this now. This is my Google Pixel. And with the with the um with the case on, it fits tightly and perfectly. This is how it looks. I'm sorry, I'm trying to, so y'all can get to see it, but this is how it will look within the Google. So you can take pictures of it. I mean, you, you can take pictures with it. You can set it down. And from what I understand, this rotates. So these things can rotate up and down. So say if you want it to go a certain way, you can rotate these things up and down within here so you can have it go lay flat or lay back. Now, I'm going to tell you something right now. If you have a screen protector on this, you might want to uh, be careful because it did just at the bottom. My screen protector is kind of bubbling up because of the pressure that's on these. But I can get those bubbles out. I know how to do that. So if you have a screen protector, please be careful. Um, but what you can do, you can take these and these are supposed to slide up or down depending on how you want this. So if you put it in like this, like a, um, you could do landscape like that, but then these things in here move, they slide up and down. So you can actually tilt it forward and backwards. So um, I have to read the whole, I have to read everything about it because I don't want to break it because it's not delicate, but because I don't know how to really use it. Oh, here we go. There we go. It, um, you can move these up. And I moved it up with my hand. Now, these things are not easy to move up. Um, but I guess they have to be sturdy so you can put your phone. So now I have it up. So I can have it up like that. And you can have your phone like that. You know, or, you know, you can be taking, you know, or if you want to take a picture looking all the way up, you move these things. Cause they, they come out, let me see if I can move. Okay, that's better. So come out, so you can move these things up and down so that you can get better angles with the phone. So that's how it look when it's in the position it needs to be. Flip it up. I mean, until I get to use it, use it. Um, for right now, it works. It stands up. I can um, do time time lapse photography, or I can you know be doing a nice little pose and get the angle I want to get, and you know take the um, get the um, get the snapshot. Um, just just sitting in my bed, you know, putting on my nightstand and being able to put it, you know, in landscape mode and watch a movie, you know, and then you can um, you know, like I said, you can tilted forward or backwards so i mean right now given my initial just my initial really just my initial um impressions i think is okay i will have to use it more to see how delicate it is how it will survive um being pulled in let me get a mock wallet out of my my drawer a wallet i don't normally use so here you know i don't no normally use this wallet but let's see if it can fit you know, in one of these, as it says. So I'm going to push it back in. I'm going to turn it around. Boom, here we go here. And then I'm going to see if it will fit. Maybe in one of these little slots here. Because that's... Oh, and it does. It actually... Look at this. 
it fits in the slot. So it fits as a credit box, credit card size. So I like it. I mean, I've never used nothing like this, but I'm going to use it. Um, maybe I'll do a small review on this one. Um, so stay tuned for most likely part two, because I will have to get to use it, get to see, um, take some videos with it, you know, just see if it if it is something I can really use, um, you know, on a daily basis, or if not just a daily basis, on a, um, you know, every now and then. I mean, it's very thin. It's not, it's not made cheaply. It's very sturdy in this construction. I mean, just being able to do that and snaps back in. So I don't know how long, you know, if it'll become, I mean, over time, you're gonna work it loose. It'll become looser. Um, it'll become loose. It'll become more, un, um, it'll become, this is rigid now, it'll become more, less rigid than what it is. Um, but I'll see how it do, how it, how it does. This has been your boy, the guy to argue for Pastor Tech, bringing you the tri, the Pocket Tripod Pro card size tripod for mobility, for mobile photography. And if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel as we bring you more fun unboxings. You have a good day. Peace.